Gas turbines like this CFM56 are the most efficient means of propulsion known to mankind. But today, even that isn't enough. Engine makers are always looking for the next leap forward in propulsive efficiency, especially when it comes to the materials that they use deep inside engines like this one. CFM's marketing vice president, Francois Houzenet, has granted Flight Global access to one of the most exclusive rooms at this air show where it keeps its most advanced technologies. Well, the previous generation of, uh, of blades made out of uh, carbon fiber were layers of carbon fiber uh, fitted by hand on top of each other uh, to, into the shape uh, of the blade. Uh, they were made for bigger blades uh, and for uh, long-range aircraft that do not have as many takes off as uh, the single market requires. So for this new generation, uh, we have been weaving that carbon fiber in 3D. So you don't just have layers next to each other, but you have uh, weaving uh, in the all three uh, directions in three dimension and this is actually one just one piece of material weaving all together. So simply this new technology uh, adds strength to uh, the material and to the blade because on the previous generation of carbon fiber blades were for uh, bigger uh, engines, uh, so stronger, bigger blades uh, that could handle bird strike. Uh, but uh, birds don't scale down, but we had to scale down those blades. So we needed uh, stronger blades to be able uh, to handle uh, those impact that engines could, uh, could meet. These blades are the uh, low pressure turbine blades. So they're uh, fitted in the back of the engines. Uh, the low pressure turbine uh, is the turbine that gives power to the fan uh, back in the front of the engine engines. So basically those blades are designed to capture part of the energy coming from the air uh, from, that is coming from the core and then brings that energy to the fan and make it turn to, to load it to provide most of the thrust of, uh, of the engine. So those two blades are CFM56 design uh, blades, so uh, the present generation design. Well, the difference we're showing here uh, to the people that visit our technological room is uh, the difference of material that we want to put the emphasis on. Uh, this blade is uh, the usual alloy that we use for CFM66. This one is uh, the mix of titanium and aluminum, uh, TIAL, that uh, we will use for the LEAP engines. It's a much lighter ma material, much more resistant material that will allow us to have a, a bigger low pressure turbine but with a light weight. Well, the big challenge we had with our, with our new engines, uh, to make a good fuel efficient engines, you need a big fan and you need an efficient core. It's about a 50-50 mix. And if you get a big fan, you need a big turbine, and, uh, but big, big, big adds weight, weight, weight. And basically, all the gain you have from having big parts, uh, you don't want to lose it by being too heavy. So uh, the key technologies for CFM was really to develop light technologies and uh, the carbon fiber uh, and uh, the, the metal, um, uh, the new metal used will save weight, will about save about 500 uh, pounds per engine compared as if it would have been made out of regular metal as on the present generation of engines.